what is up my name is Olivia welcome to my youtube channel we're taking it vlog style today because we have something super exciting to film I'm done with my mental breakdowns for the day <laughs> love that for me what we're gonna do today we are going to be filming purse packing but we're going next level today all right, me and my family, we're heading on a trip to Colorado. We're going for about five days. They have all accepted the challenge of purse packing. So my brother, my mom, and my dad are all purse packing for this trip, myself included. But the thing that is extra interesting about this time is that this purse packing is going to be even smaller than my last video. So if you haven't seen that, I'll definitely put it in the description. I'll link it up top somewhere in the vicinity. This video is going to be very challenging because now I have to fit all of my goodies in this itty bitty REI backpack that is about the size of like two of my heads. So it's not big at all. Let's see how we can do this because I know that we can. Just to clarify, in this little bitty backpack, I've got to fit five to four days worth of clothing that is cold weather approved. I've got to fit also my cosmetics and any odds and ends that I need, including an extra bag and my wallet, which my wallet's pretty big. Oh, and my laptop because <laughs> we're on that school grind. Anyway, okay. Here's the run through real quick. We've got a tripod. We've got one pair of REI active pants, one long sleeve shirt, Guy Harvey shirt. I've got a pair of REI long active pants that I've rolled up and then tucked into the leg. We've got a tank top that can be tossed at the end of the trip or donated. We've got a nice little blouse here that was actually my last purse bag video. So we've got that striped Shein shirt. That's gonna be great for either going out or even just a day in the town. We've got a long sleeve shirt that can double as a sleep shirt as well. Okay, we've got a pair of cropped leggings here. They're nice and comfy for hikes or leisure. We've got a pair of long Target leggings. We've got a tosser tee. Now this is a very old, as you can see, it's from 2014. This is gonna be tossed at the end. I wouldn't even donate it, it's that ratty. We've got a pair of thick socks here. I also have four additional pairs that I'm going to grab. You won't see them here right now. Um, I've got a pair of sleeping shorts. I've got five or six pairs of underwear. You get a headband here that I got from Thailand, but it's super Colorado if you ask me. And then I've got a sports bra. Okay, now that we have that, I'm also going to be packing my laptop my calculator because I have to take st statistics. All right guys, so I wanted to go through what's gonna be in my two bags, which honestly, I think I brought a little too much makeup. I might take some out. I might toss some as well. It's kind of old. We'll go through it. In my, basically like my bathroom bag, I've got facial makeup remover wipes body wash, a little travel size bliss face wash, body lotion in a reusable container, feminine products, and of course I've got my deodorant. So I'm gonna strategically stack this. Hopefully I can finesse the odd shapes of all of these products. That's my bathroom bag. My mom, who's also coming, is bringing shampoo and conditioner, but she has a similar bag. Now, for cosmetics, this is kind of chaotic. Let's see what I can and can't live without. I definitely need my acne medicine. Birth control pills will go in here as well. I've got to take them out. Eyeshadow palette that I'm gonna take. Face, contour, and eyeshadow brush. Our Anastasia brow products. Fake beauty blender. This, I might go without it. This is just translucent powder. I need my contour. I've got my my concealer, I'm an idiot. I've got my Becca highlighter, mascara, eyeliner, that's a necessity. And then of course I got my e.l.f. foundation, which doesn't really match, so that might be tossed as well. Okay, so I'm gonna put all of these and try and stack the likes, shape, like the shapes.
cosmetics bag. This is less space than if you were to take a full size bag with all of your trinkets in it. Um, and these, if you take all the air out of these little Ziploc baggies, they also can conform to spaces in your bag or your purse that you're taking. I'm ready to start stuffing, so let's do this. Let's get to work. Okay, you guys, this bag is so small. I'm, ha I'm actually having a hard time purse packing it. So, I think I've come up with the perfect Tetris shaped bag that the airline will not have a problem with. So let's, let me show you. At the bottom here, so I put in my laptop and its sleeve, that's good to go. I've got those capri pants that I'm gonna tuck up here, kind of securing that laptop in a way. Taking these rolled pants and pushing them to the very, very bottom, as hard as I can because we need as much space as possible. Then I'm going to take the black REI pants, tank top, and blouse, fold it like a taco. So not rolling it this time, but placing it as close to the corner as possible while trying to fit in two sports bras, my hairband, and sleep shorts on the other side here simultaneously so that they both, you know, are in there as tight as possible and can't really move around. Like that. So we're already running out of space. I'm getting nervous. Um, let's see, four. So socks and underwear are pretty much one of the most important things here. These guys have to go in. So right now we're looking at about with the clothes I'll be wearing over, we've got about seven outfit options. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine actually. Okay, so this is a necessity. This will go up top with the capris securing the laptop, as you can see. So there's a little compact spot down here. This would be good for shirts that are thin material, our cosmetics, or our chargers. So. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take this cosmetic bag, make sure all the air is out. Like that. Actually, I think you could fold it over, so let's try that. All the air is out like that. We'll set that there. Perfect. Makeup. We'll try and get all the air out of that. We'll set that on top. Hopefully we can close that up there. And then what I'm gonna do is I need at least one more shirt. Okay, we're gonna take that cute Shein blouse like that and this tosser tee. Roll that up as well. These guys are going in. But first, I'm gonna try and take this out so I can make sure this little Shein shirt gets in there. And it might help at this point to close one side and sort of stuff things into the uh, to the side away from me. And let's go ahead and try and fit this as well. This is gonna pretty much go on top, shut it down. Like I said, I don't really care about that shirt. I use it as a sleeper shirt or just like an active day away shirt. It's this time now. So what I'm gonna do is tuck that makeup in there, make sure it's in a secure place to where nothing will puncture it. And then this flat side with the wipes is gonna go against it so that my bottles, my acne medicine doesn't get punctured as well. Closing it up, maybe, there we go. Alrighty, now this is bursting at the seams. Not really, but almost. But there you guys go. All right guys, we did it. We got all of our goodies to Colorado, cold weather clothes in this purse pack tutorial. Um, this, I mean, this actually technically is a backpack, but it's smaller than my purse that I did the purse packing video in. 
which again, you should definitely watch that. It took off on my channel. So if you did watch it, thank you so much. And hopefully this video is just as helpful. I've got about 10 outfits in this purse. And if you include the options of what I'm going to be wearing on the airplane, we are going to be good to go in Colorado. The only things I did not include in my bag, which I do need to account for, is my wallet, which I have here. I do recommend that you get a wristlet or a, a type of clutch that you don't mind holding. Um, you are going to need your ID when you're going through security. You're gonna have your ticket, which you can include and tuck away in your wristlet as well. And then when you're on the plane, you can simply tuck it into a pocket or you can keep it on your person, which if you're traveling alone, I recommend you keep it on your person because you never know who you're sitting next to. I also didn't include my chargers, which I will find a, hopefully a way to tuck some of them in here. If not, my family does have iPhones so we can share chargers, which is a huge benefit. I didn't include these socks. I didn't get to fit that in here. This calculator, I'm gonna have to find a way. Maybe there's room in somebody else's bag. Then again, most people don't carry around calculators, so you should still be able to do this tutorial. Unless you're forced to take statistics and you're dying on the inside like I am. I didn't include these long leggings, but that's okay because they are not squat proof, if you know what I mean. Um, this old t-shirt I didn't get to include. Um, I will bring this. I think I'm going to hold it because I'm going to be vlogging in the airport. So that's my way around that. And this other long sleeve, which again was sort of a non-necessary long sleeve. Yeah. All right, guys, let's see how it looks here. Oh God, the laptop is definitely in there. I'll tell you that much. My shoulder blades felt that. So this is how she looks. Nice and cute tiny but very efficient so that's all i have for you guys today on this let's go check in with my family and see how their purse packing went how did your purse packing experience go 10 out of 10 easily easy well he wasn't a concern this is your purse packing wonderful no problem at all really it's packed it is yeah packed my well. backpacks dad how was your pa per purse packing perfect this is he was up. the most stressed out of all of us, mm -hmm. considering taping his backpack to conform to the shape that the airline needs it to be. <laughs> That's just how we do things. <laughs> Alrighty, we're about to head out. I've got my little neck thing, headphones, wallet, my outfit that I'm going to be wearing. I've got a couple shirts layered here. And my backpack, ready to go. Bye, Toby. <laughs> Guys. It's like 90 degrees here in Florida. I'm sweating buckets, but I've got on my outfit one pair of shoes for the trip should do me well and We're purse packed and ready to go We just got to the airport. We are heading to Colorado Family's all here. We all purse packed super exciting um, What we're gonna do is go through security and uh, have a photo shoot Chick-fil-a Secured. Bags? Secured. Flight to Colorado? About to be secured. Cheers. Why are those fries extra warm? They went through radiation. <laughs> cool. Let's do this. Alright.